Well, the mission in the Exploratorium is to change how the world learns. And if you're gonna change how the world learns, you need to go out to where the world is learning every day. Living Innovation Zones are a brand new idea. It's a recognition that in places like Market Street, we don't have any places for people to stop and engage and enjoy the urban life. It's very formal right now. We're trying to loosen up. We have public space in the city and we have these amazing innovators that are all around us, but there's very little expression of those innovations in public space. So the idea was, well, let's commission or involve or collaborate with innovators at various parts of Market Street to improve public space. We wanted to partner with the Exploratorium because there's three things that the Exploratorium does well. Innovation, fun, and education. And as a partner, we're hoping that they'll bring some of that energy to the streets. So one of the ways we're thinking about conceptually developing these exhibits is through observation, communication, and experimentation. One of the ideas we have is to actually lift the platform up off the street so you have a bit of an observation deck to watch people and watch motions. We have one idea it's called whispering dishes. They're basically big domes, and you can sit in the middle of this dish and whisper to a person in another dish 50 or 60 feet away, and it's crystal clear. Another idea we're playing with is the idea of a bench that's slightly V. And along that V, you mark stranger or acquaintance or friend or close friend. So by choosing simply where you sit on the bench, you're also acknowledging the kind of relationship that you have with the person nearby. I mean, in some ways, this is the fun part, where you're so early in a project, the ideas are just flowing. When we make something, generally we start with raw material. We start with the raw material of a phenomena. In this case, the raw material is the people and the place and the surroundings. It's an immense amount of resources. They're about people and about how people interact in space. And what you'll see when the innovation zone is introduced, is people stopping, interacting with it, interacting with each other, laughing, smiling. It's gonna be a whole new experience where you can have fun on Market Street. It's not just about getting from one place to the other. It's about engaging in the space and saying, wow, this is an amazing city and look what's happening right here. I never knew this could happen here on Market Street. And that's what the Exploratorium is going to bring to the space. So thanks for listening. You got to know a project like this doesn't work without your participation. So not only financial support, but participating in the prototyping, the public prototyping we'll be doing of these ideas over time. The city's opened up an amazing opportunity along Market Street for us to participate in, for all of us to participate in. So I, I hope you're as excited as we are to see what comes out at the other end. And I gotta tell you, this kind of work, it's really fun. <laughs> you really want to be a part of it. So we're inviting you in and I hope you'll come play with us and I hope you can help be a part of what's gonna transform Market Street. Hello, I'm Mayor Ed Lee and I'm proud to be mayor of San Francisco, the innovation capital of the world. I'm also excited to announce our Living Innovation Zones project. These zones are an innovative approach to activate our public realm and create vibrant streets in San Francisco for all of our residents and visitors to enjoy. We're partnering with the Exploratorium, one of the most innovative places in our world-class city, to launch the first Living Innovation Zone. Now all of you have the opportunity to get involved and get inspired to shape a fantastic new public space. Let's bring new life and the innovative spirit to the streets of San Francisco.